Let's use a simple camera store as an example. Yahoo refers to each product as an item. Our store has a total of eight products, or items. If we were to create a one-page store and put all the items on that page, it would look like this. It's easy to recognize that this is a bit cluttered, and when you have, say, a hundred items or more, it's going to be very difficult for your customers to shop for the item they're looking for. So, to organize your store, Yahoo allows you to create sections. When you create sections, you place products in groups. We can separate our cameras from our tripods by creating two sections, called cameras and tripods. When we create these sections, our store becomes a more structured site with a home page and links to each section page. Also, when you create these sections, a button is created on the sidebar. When we create the camera section, this camera button was automatically created. The same is true for the tripod section. This navigation bar is available from every page on your site. The section buttons allow your customers to easily navigate your site by going directly to a specific section in your store. We'll go into a more detailed description of Yahoo store structure in Volume 2.